All right, we're going to go and mix a couple more songs. Say hey to the cat. He doesn't have a name because he doesn't need one. He is who he is, and he's stronger than names are. That's how a lot of people are, too. You know what I'm they are what they do. The actions, they do speak louder than the words do. And they really do. And there's nothing you can do to change that because it's a good thing. Now we'll go ahead and go through here and find us some more beats that we made. Sounds like hunting to me. <laughs> it's a good sound. Because it doesn't sound the same. That's the point. It's just, you know, sometimes you make something that doesn't sound the same and it's still not good. <laughs> but I don't care about how good it sounds. I just want it to sound not the same. Or I want it to sound how I want it without it sounding like someone else's shit. sounds funky as fuck and that sounds like a real boss like actually rapping you know I, I wanted to make that so bad simple but it sounds good you know it sounds beautiful one we can just loop that and it sounds great you know i don't know what else could be added to it you know without it sounding normal you know, i don't want it to sound normal i mean there's no instrument that you can't add you know to it Copy the this bar here, copy track seven and one through eight and track seven. <laughs> one this side of nine. <laughs> simpler of a treasure i mean this is five minutes and we've already got that idea and all we need is this loop because i mean some of these beats are just going to be loops and you just have to deal with it but it doesn't sound like anybody else's shit and it doesn't piss anyone off because it doesn't sound like them <laughs> and that's what's important you know is not sounding like they do you know shift mix down you know and that's all i care about is just not sounding like them you know and i could care less if it's going to sound any different And I can't notice that it does. You know, I got to be able to make it 16. We'll start at 32. 
just to have that little bit there. Just let it sit, you know. Just let it sit. Just enjoy this right here. You know, think about, you know, we have country, we have you know, any type of sound that comes with it. And you know, it just wouldn't be right without, you know, a good friend. You know, that just thought about this shit. You know, it sounds really good and I think it's got a lot of soul in it. You know, it definitely doesn't say much about shit that people would say. Probably the song material would probably be about other shit that it doesn't sound like. That way I'd be original. I mean, all I can do is use whatever no one else is using that I want to use. <laughs> if there's nothing there, I won't make any music. There's something there, you know, and you can always add your own feeling. This one minute a sign, and then we'll go over here and write, and then we'll sample, and then we'll save it, and then that'll be a wrap for that one. And we'll probably do a couple more. If you feel like it. You look like you do because your eyeballs seem kind of mechanical. And, you know, maybe that's why. You, know, you probably have lots of ambition, especially if you don't close your eyes. You know, I have, you know, lids and, you know, I do close mine once in a while. But, you know, you look like a camera and you know, I don't know what else you would be. You know, you're always watching camera. You know, you don't have a blinker. If you if you could blink somehow, you know, it'd make it a lot easier to remember what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Like, if there was enough shit going on, you can blink at certain times, you know, if it was a camera. You could at least have enough personality, you know, to have human thoughts, you know, if you were a fucking camera. Because, <laughs> you know, I mean, if it blinks, you know, when you remember something and you're watching it through the camera... You know, it blinks one time, you know, when too much of something piles up, it blinks. You know, and if, if that did that, you did that, you know, and you blinked when you understood something or, you know, blink, you know, occasionally, you know, but at, not at like clock intervals. It'd have to be like, it'd have to be like uh, some other form of interval, you know, one to where, you know, it has enough sound and then all of a sudden everything stops and it can blink. You know, or there could be one, you know, like one that kind of blinks, you know, while sound's going on and then it kind of has a dip for a minute and then it blinks if it has enough time to blink there and it quits and then it blinks and like it wants something or it's thinking about something and then it looks back, you know, and then that way the camera can blink and then it would be like, oh, okay, and we can register how this shit looks because all the shit we watch on TV and on the computer, the problem is, is that the screen doesn't blink. You know, it should be an eyeball that blinks, you know, and it just blinks every once in a while, you know? I mean, they should have somebody even a fucking program, you know, that makes your computer that you use or your Android blink, you know, every once in a while, and it looks like your eyeball's blinking. It should have like a red, you know, thing that goes in the back, and, you know, when you're on your Android, you know, it can just blink every once in a while, you know, and that way... You can kind of pick up what's going on, but it'd have to use three or four different intervals. And we're going to talk about these motherfuckers now, because that sounds very cool. And that's what I think about. So, yeah. And, you know, it's hard to it's hard to think with your ears, you know, if your ears don't blink as well. You know, and see, my ears blink. And, you know, when you listen to a recording and you look at it for the first time, a recording goes all the way through, but it doesn't blink. And that's why music sucks right now, is because... It's almost like sex. I mean, how can you have sex for that long and not be able to take a break just for a minute and blink while you're having sex? I mean, if, it, if it's a computer and it's got us thinking like that, then we're working our way through a tube and then it's not going to blink. Like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? I mean, all it needs is to be able to blink because it's got to capture the projectiles that are coming at it. You know, it's like watching the damn uh, space screensaver. You know, it's got all, all the like stars and shit coming at you, you know? And I mean, if you could just blink for a minute, you know, because of the stars, you, you wouldn't get bored watching it, you know, because it needs to blink while you're motherfucking watching it, you know? And all they need in artificial intelligence is just a way to blink, you know? And I mean, if you want good sex, you know, I mean, it's just like friends kissing. I mean, you can't just constantly regular kiss somebody, you know, you've got to be able... And you can't just put your mouth up to, you know, next person's mouth and it just goes in it, 
you know, because you, you can't just, ah, you have to be able to kiss, you know, there's got to be, I mean, you know, if a computer is going to know how to think, I mean, it needs to know that, you know, we have heartbeats and we blink, you know, every time to see what's going on when we use our heartbeats, you know, and it's not like it's weird, it's just the truth, you know what I'm saying, you don't think about it. And that's the problem, you know, if you have a mechanical heart, because you have to be able to blink. And I mean, that motherfucker's got to be able to blink. And it's like before our, our electricity shoots out of the pulses, it blinks every time to capture what's going on and then it shoots it in. You, you know, I mean, some people might work differently if they wanted to, but still, you'd have to be able to blink if we were computers. And we're just looking at it. You know, I mean, to me, it's like having a cigarette. It's like, how can you have a computer that's on for that long? But the only thing it does is not blink. It's got to be able to, because it'd be wide open, you know. If I was a camera right now, if I was watching it from here, I'd get sleepy. You know, just because it doesn't blink. And I think that's important. I mean, that's what I get out of it. That's what I'm, that's what I understand, you know. I don't understand anything else about it. You know, it blinks. And, you know, if a computer's not going to blink, I mean, I know it has binary code and it's got 0 and 1, but it should have a 2, you know, to go with it. So, you know, it can kind of do what it's doing and take a break, and then it can really take a break at 3. You know what I'm saying? So it'd be like 1, 2, 3 code, you know, 0, 1, and 2, and 3 if it wants it. You know, because, I mean, you might need an extra break, you know, just to take that break. You know, and it's got to be able to take a break and not let shit happen, you know, which would be probably an earthquake or national disaster or something gets really loud and elevated and sounds fucked up. Music starts playing, you know, sounds bad. And then it would know, you know, how to respond. So anyway, I think we got this thing wrote, if I'm not mistaken. I just don't remember because I wasn't having fun. I think we did. Sample right completed. All right. And now we'll save the song. I mean, we got a bunch of these to go through, and I wish that we could go through all of them together, you know, but I only have so much memory on this thing. I don't think that's stupid. I think there should be more memory, because if it could blink, I'm sure it could find a way to fit some more memory in there. If it could take a fucking break for a minute. That's why we're way smarter than any computer could ever be. And it doesn't matter how many, because they don't know how to blink. You know, and they could be dumb and still do shit they're supposed to do. They shouldn't be that retarded. You know, I mean, you are not motherfucking dumber than a million microprocessors, <laughs> you know, because, you know, you blink and they still haven't blinked. So that's like one thought and they still haven't been able to do it. You know, <laughs> I mean, that's why a robot is going to start going over here and doing other shit, you know, and you can look at retarded people as a fucking spectrogram and see, you know, this is bullshit. And, you know, that person looks stupid. But because we have robots over here, here's a person who acts like a robot, you know, and you can see. How the robot's not as smart as a human. <laughs> and it's because it can't take a break and just blink for a minute, you know, and have spurts. You know, that's all it needs, like a muscle, you know. And shit needs to be organic, too, you know, when it comes to thoughts. And especially artificial intelligence. It has to be able to pulse. It should not be able to sit and wait. And that's not even a pulse, and it's not even a wait. You know, it's got to have a way to sit there, and when it stops, you know, it's not counting shit. It needs to completely stop, you know. That's where they're fucking up, because you have a computer that's running the whole time, but it won't fucking stop for a minute, you know, and it's got to be able to cut on and off, you know, like a heartbeat, you know, instead of a, you know, regular computer, and I think that shit's important. You know, I don't know how the fuck you could not think <laughs> that that's not important. I mean, that's what it would be if someone wrote, you know, something in a blog about it. That's what it would be about, and it would need pulse, and it would need to breathe, and, you know, it's just like looking at uh, StarCraft and how they have Zerg, Terran, and Proteus. And the problem is, is that the Zergs are the ones that we need to be more like because they're organic and they use this to do things right. And if everything was made of human flesh and it was that evolved and it could take a pulse, you know, and kind of shed some of the electric stuff, you know, it would have a pulse that would be, you know, a lot better than what I think technology would be. I think that's important.
That's what that's what I'm thinking about when I'm making a song. It's how important this shit could be later. When I'm gone. For sure. You know, and I mean, really when I'm still there, you know, but I mean I hope that that would be an advancement, you know, is that they'd have things that have pulses and, you know, can actually, you know, calculate correctly instead of you know, not, because it's important. I don't have any drums, I'm not going to fuck with it. There's got to be some in here that has some volume or something. I mean, we've only done two, and they're not even that good. We have better shit in here. Oh, man, I got one that is so fucked up, you're going to like it. I mean, it, oh man, I mean, I always, <laughs> like my little musician in me, man, is going to bring you like a little gift, you know, it sounds good right here, it doesn't need to be fucked with, it sounds like Crack Commandments, but it's just a little bit juicier, you know, I love that shit, audio track shift, and mix down, mix down, <laughs> that sounds good. You know what I mean? I love that shit. I think it sounds motherfucking great. There's nothing else that needs to be added to it. It just doesn't need any more. And that's it. And the little oh, sample memory is full. Fuck. That's not good. Oh, no. Don't tell me that. Well, we still gotta write it, baby. That's not full. God, now I'm writing. I mean, we have more beats. I mean, how could that be it? How could that be all the memory? I thought that was it. How could that be? <laughs> Doesn't make any sense to me. All right, yeah. Let's go ahead. We'll load another one if we can. Hopefully, there'll be something here. There's got to be something good in here. supposed to fucking sound normal. It's supposed to sound different. Sample memory full. How do I free up the fucking memory then? <laughs> what do I do? D delete? I mean, how do I find something I can get rid of if the sample memory is full? What the fuck do I do? How do I do that? File utility. <sighs> Tip. I mean, how could it have too much? I mean, what the fuck? These aren't supposed to be on there. Let's go ahead and mark all these motherfuckers and delete them. I don't know what these are. They're not even playable. Let's get rid of all these motherfuckers. Some tracks from some CD someone made. I don't want the shit. You know, maybe that'll clear up some room for it. I'll go over here, do it again. Wait. Song edit, audio track, audio mix down. Sample memory full. What the fuck? Oh, God, that sucks. Let's see what else we can get rid of. God damn it, I'm so sorry about this. But it's got to be done. I mean, we got to get this shit saved. And, you know, no matter what, you know, we'll pull through it. And, you know, I'm just not seeing it. <laughs> I'm not seeing that. No, 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 no. Don't card the format. Card format. There's nothing on the user file. But, you know, there should be room on the... Ah, fuck. Card. 
Uh, how do we go down? Shit. Man, we on the landslide now, man. We're not gonna fucking make it back up. Not with this type of shit going on. No, I don't want to format the fucking card. Sample. There's got to be something in here. There's nothing in that. Oh, shit, there is. I gotta get rid of something in this motherfucker. I don't see it. I'm gonna say I don't see shit in here. Let's figure out what you doing with this bitch. I'll just do a showcase of the beats. I'll let you hear. Let's see. Up, up. Do you feel? No.